I hear from Alberta families who tell me they're frustrated with the chaos in our health care. We know families deserve a relationship with a family doctor who knows them and has their histories, who's a phone call away when they are sick or hurt. They deserve world-class access to public health care. Currently, as many as 800,000 Albertans don't have access to a family doctor. So my message to every one of them is that under an NDP government, if you need a doctor, you will get a doctor. Well, in terms of the, the immediate success of the plan and the, the first stages of the plan, it is actually focused more on, on uh, expanding the capacity of current doctors to see more patients by giving them more supports around the practice that they deliver so they actually have the ability to see more patients. So that's one of the things that is, that is fundamental to the model. Going forward, and what we've heard from, from many doctors, including doctors like uh, Dr. Coakley here, is that uh, you'll actually succeed in, in recruiting more doctors and bringing more doctors back into practice if they are given the, the opportunity uh, to practice in these kinds of team settings where they are more supported and they're able to uh, focus on what it is they went to school for, which was to care for patients rather than doing all this other running of businesses. So nobody should have to pay a premium to get access to comprehensive coordinated care. That should be a given because that makes uh, the, the, the success of, of the health care services that people receive greater and it takes pressure off the whole system. So commodifying that, making people have to pay for that, is the exact opposite of what we want to do. We don't want people's health care and the quality of their health care to depend on whether they can afford any one of a number of extra fees that Danielle Smith and the UCP are intent on imposing on Albertans.